Hey gamers, it's me, Shinobi Nando, and today is a very good day if you got the collector's edition of Fallout 76. That's, it's Vault 101, I know. Bear with me. Normally, I open up my videos with like a cheesy little sketch, one of my dad jokes, but this is kind of a serious matter. Now, a lot of you will know the controversy surrounding Fallout 76 in terms of the game, but unless you're co a collector, I've been following the, the, the controversy or the drama very, very closely, you might not have known of what happened with the collector's edition. So just a quick recap for those of you who don't. When originally advertised, this collector's edition, the, the Fallout 76 Power Armor Edition, was supposed to come with what was called a canvas bag. You can clearly see it here in all of the marketing. It, it states it's a canvas bag. Uh, it's supposed to be high quality, durable, uh, something you could store the helmet in. And what we got instead, was this cheap nylon one. Now some of you might say, Nando, buyer beware, right? You pre-order this collector's edition, you get what you get. But no, this was a blatant case of false advertising and it was more the fact that the way Bethesda went about it, first stating that they apparently ran out of canvas or had a canvas shortage, and then trying to essentially buy us off with 500 atoms. Now 500 atoms can't buy you anything in the cosmetic store anything worth of any value anyways. So after a lot of fan outrage and everything like that, especially considering the collector's edition was like 174 pounds, the game not being so good. I did a rant and an unboxing for this. And in, in my own video, I even state that if the game was really, really good, we might have excused the cheap nylon bag. Not everyone would have, but I might have. As you do sometimes just get cheap tap along with your collector's edition and the, the main item you were buying it for was the, the power armor helmet. Fair enough, that was of good quality, I, I really liked it, but blatantly mis-selling something and then blaming it on something strange like a, a canvas shortage, not alerting people before the point of sale. But after much feedback, credit where credit's due, Bethesda said they would replace it. Or so we thought, it's not just of their own goodwill, a lot of YouTubers, a lot of larger YouTubers, were quick to point out that they had these influencer special Fallout 76 bags, and lo and behold, they were made out of canvas, which kind of, again, slapped hardcore collectors and fans of the Fallout series in the face. As is to say, you ran out of canvas because you were giving it away for free for all your uh, 100,000, 1 million subscriber Fallout YouTube channel affiliates. All right, enough about that. Let's check out and see if the quality is improved from the cheap nylon one. Uh, I'll be comparing the two, seeing if the helmet fits, seeing if maybe I'm basically just letting you know if it was worth the wait of six months to get this finally fixed right oh so it's just a plain packaging it is it is fabric it is not nylon there you go um okay i don't know if you call that all right, I suppose that it is canvas. Uh, it looks very similar to the other one. Didn't see there. West Tech, West Tech. Um, it is it is big. It is more akin to a duffel bag, like they said it would be. I'll get some side by side comparisons for you guys, and then see if the helmet fits. All right, guys, this is the canvas bag. Looks a bit small, to be honest. We'll have to give it a better look in a second. You can see there, uh, it has the kind of, yeah, that, that's definitely, you know, fabric and not cheap nylon. Don't know if that is classed as canvas though. I don't know if the helmet's gonna fit. Let's just check that out. All right, okay, that's the Power Armor Edition helmet. Um, at first glance, this doesn't look like it's gonna fit, but why not? We'll give it a go. Oh, maybe. All right, okay, I take it back. It, it does definitely fit the helmet, so spin it around, give the old cheeky zip up. Well, there you have it, it does fit the helmet, okay? Um, that's, that's what it was designed for, so <laughs> kudos Bethesda. Let's compare it to the plastic nylon version now. There is the plastic one, the nylon one, you can see there, compared to the canvas one. 
I think the canvas one's a bit smaller, but it might just be the material. Now, this is a different collector's edition, but this is something else that was similar price. It's Destiny 2 collector's edition. Came with Hawthorne's bag. You could tell the kind of build quality difference. Now, in the Destiny 2 collector's edition, that is the premium item that you're paying for, is the Hawthorne's bag. But I was expecting the material maybe to be a bit more similar. Could be wrong. The Destiny 2 one's meant to be denim. But as you can see, the second layer is supposed to be canvas. And I'd say it's a much better quality than the Fallout 76 one. So there it is. There's the canvas bag we were long promised. Again, I don't know. I'd call that. It's definitely fabric, but is, is that actually canvas? Like, I'm not an expert. On materials by any means by any stretch of the imagination well, i thought canvas was supposed to kind of be like that military braided material um right yeah well i guess it'll have to do i don't think they're gonna give us another one let me know what you think in the comments down below is it too little too late i think i still got the 500 atoms i don't know i traded in the game after a month because nothing to do I was hoping that I'd end this video with, you know, like a vindication, but um, after opening it up, it's, I don't, I've stopped caring or maybe I was still expecting something better. I don't know. It's still, it still doesn't look like the bag advertised in my opinion. Maybe I'm just being picky. Again, let me know what you think. Give this video a like if you enjoyed it, if you found it informative, if you we're following the drama of Fallout 76. And as always, subscribe for more unboxings. Or feel free to check out the fall other Fallout content that I have on the channel. And thank you so much for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Bye. Bye.